Play big, baby. Placing some bets. I smell money. And making some money. What's going on, world? Brand new episode of Open the Box there on your screen. I'm your host, George Kill, and I'm here with my guy, Bleezy, in Delaware at Gallery 302. Bleezy, what's going on, man? What's going on, man? Yeah. Nice meeting you. Nice to finally make it happen, man. You know, we've been talking for a, while. a few months. Now, Gallery 302, take me back to the origin of how you started the shop, why you started the shop, and uh, the vision you and Justin had. Well, me and him always had that entrepreneurial type of mind frame. So we took all that positive energy and just put it towards our passion and just putting together this like amazing platform for the community. Both of you guys are from New York. Right? Yeah, we're from the Bronx. You're from the Bronx. Uh, what made you want to open up a shop in Delaware? It made sense because, you know, we want to stand apart. This is being done in New York a hundred times. It's not being done a hundred times here in Delaware. So we just saw it as being an open market to come over here and really just take over. We found this location. We went running with it. We were lucky enough to find something so close to the university. As strategic as it was picking this location, that's as strategic we are with hiring the employees. We got a few of the students who are able to promote for us, bring clientele in on a daily. It's just a blessing. All right, Jay, you're the perfect person to talk about inventory. Like, Jay is is a big time. Are you still a big time sneaker? Uh, if you call a washed up, you okay, know, 30 something year old sneaker head. It's being humble. It's being humble. I wanted to start out by putting you on the spot. Give me five shoes that have been in here. You would say are, are probably some of the rare shoes you've seen that have touched the shelves of Gallery 302. I would say Cause 4, okay. one of my favorites. It's super clean. Cause is one of my favorite artists. I have him tattooed on my hand. Um, I love Cause. Gotta love Travis Scott. Sixes, Olive, British Khaki. Travis Scott does some of the best Nike collabs to this day. These you don't see too often. Chinese New Year Air Jordan 1 Lows, especially in the set. I love these. I love Jordan 1 Lows. I would come to the Union Dunk. Union Dunk don't release till April. To the Union 4. Classic, probably one of the best collabs of 2019. Um, that would be some of my favorites. What was Delaware's culture uh, in regards to sneakers before you guys got here? To be honest, I was kind of shocked. There's a lot of kids reselling, trading shoes, buying and selling on Facebook. It reminded me a little bit of when I was living in New York um, and the community embraced us. When you guys first started, what did the inventory look like? We've had maybe a hundred shoes and we had not even 20% of the clothing that we have now. Does it ever like surprise you that you guys have been to where you are in su such a short time? It surprises me that we've grown so quickly, yes, but it doesn't surprise me because this is something that we've been planning for years. It didn't happen in Miami. It happened in Delaware, all for the right reasons. And I'm grateful for that. Now, Gino, in the sneaker space, content matters. Yeah. Like the way you, you know, showcase a shoe, a piece of apparel. Yeah, you gotta have, you gotta be on point with the yeah, pictures. Your fit. Marketing is everything. Definitely, yeah. definitely. So, you so is your fits better than any ones? Yeah, I, got the, I feel like I got the best fits in here. <laughs> <laughs> For sure. One thing that you guys do, uh, fit of the day. What is it? For fit of the day, what I do is I come in in the morning, Jay will pick out a, a piece for me, and he'll make me create a fit out of that piece, that one piece, and we sell a lot of stuff off our outfit picks. What was the one outfit in the past that you put together and you really started to see that people started to pay attention on Instagram? I had gallery sweatpants with a long sleeve gallery t-shirt and a nice. cool grays that just came out. Everybody liked that because it was real simple. So. Now, you have some items over here that you've done some some fit of the days with and just yep, some yep. stuff that you guys have. Yeah, you got some rare pieces. Yeah. Right here is a capital, super rare. Quilted on the back, smiley faces. It's all handmade, one of ones. Yeah, real clean piece. I believe I did a padder with this one. It's the aqua padder. Then I actually have the shirt on right now, but this is the hoodie of it. Grateful Dead Gallery Department, exclusive piece. Only sold on GOAT. Then we got another gallery piece, super exclusive. Tokyo Japan exclusive, painted. I would do an Air Force One with that. You can do a Lightning Four, because the on the chest, the gallery department is yellow. I would go fire with that. So I'm gonna pass you off to Robo. I'm so, he gonna tell you what he does in the shop and what he handles. How did your relationship with the two owners start? So I was actually at the Christiana Mall. Came into his store, I was shopping around, seeing what they had. And I was pointing out 
a lot of like their their hyper sneakers like their Travis Scott's their off-whites and Jay was like yeah you know the one I was really after is the Travis Scott low I never got my hand on that that's the only one I didn't have and I said funny thing say that I have an eight and an eight and a half mm -hmm. came back up I had them I brought some more crazy stuff along with me and it just built that relationship what attracted you to to want to work with them and want to build a relationship with them especially being in the east coast like you it's can a, shop anywhere I go into a lot of these stores but when I went into Gallery 302 specifically it was the interaction that I got from the team that they had there they treated me like family from the gate and then Jay the one day I came in he was like yo dude I was talking with the team why don't you work with us yeah, and yeah. that's how it all started so I'm glad it did how is the uh, the relationship with loyal customers in here when customers come in here hey what's going on dude I like your outfit talk about their outfit not necessarily what we have in here what are you looking for and it's all about the relationship and then they tell their friends their friends tell their friends and it's all about you know building Good them strong community. relationships yeah. with the community all right Frank everyone that I've interviewed previously um, they all have nicknames and you're just Frank I'm, I'm, Frank is Frank. I'm, I'm just Frank. I've been called many of things, but uh, <laughs> you know, Frank Frank is is just the the one. So what went into the thought process of what this place looks like right now? I told you from the beginning, I, I love the marble floors. <laughs> but yeah, what went into that? For me, it's all about packaging. Sneakerheads love that special box. The shoes are great, but it's how you how it came to you. So for me, the store is the package that all this comes in from the floor, how things are displayed, the flow of the store. So with customer in mind, I sat down and thought, how would I wanna shop? How can I get the best experience out of a 2,500 square foot store? What's your favorite aspect about the design of the, the shop? I would just say the ability to display everything in, in a way that the customer can, can shop you know, freely. With your expertise, your background, your career, why Gallery 302? I love feeling like a part of something. You know, at this stage, store one, um, I can look around and say, you know, I implemented that. But I feel like a brick in the foundation. So when it comes to store two, store three, you know, franchising, you know, I'm gonna be able to look back and say, hey, I, you know, I was, I was, you know, I was a major part of, of, of that, you know, plan. Another feature that, that I do want to point out that I, I think what makes Gallery 302 special is that we support independent brands. We're kind of that, that stage that, that people kind of get a start with. So we do things called pop-up shops where independent brands get to feature and sell their items on a Saturday. And, you know, they've done the design, they've done the um, artistry. Now they become the salesperson and, and more the business person behind it. We have Cream out of Philly, Crew out of Delaware, Pelf, you know, Delaware. So we have these independent brands that have done their own pop-up shops and just wowed us, you know, had lines, had followings come through and it made us stop and think that we don't need them just on Saturday. We, we need, need them all the yeah. time. You know, it works all the way around because these brands get to expand and grow and it's exclusive to us. So you have to come here in order to, to get it. So um, again, it's just another part of our success. Smitty, you have a lot to choose from here. The yeah. inventory is, is very vast. Yeah, and so you, you've been on, I, I've heard that you're the best salesman in this <laughs> shop. And yeah. so with you having so much to, to sell and, and, and so many different options, what is bought here the most? Black owned business, Green Bond, Grand Crew. You know, you got the people, high-end people coming, you get the yeah. gallery, St. Michael, Beta Nick. What about shoe wise? Shoe wise, dunks. Dunks? Dunks and really? Yeezy socks. That Yeezy and uh, Nike killed it this year. And would you say Gallery 302 has a lot of like return? customers yeah like yeah you know. we got we got people from day one i started mm -hmm. working here in july and i was a customer me starting in too like i'll come in once a week spend a couple of hours get my son something mm -hmm. then i'll probably go about my business you feel mm -hmm. me but we got a lot of returning customers our return customers turn to consignments and we build relationships from them. that's how the store grew honestly from what i from what i've seen and what i've known the one sale you're most proud of that's a hard one, because we, me and him, like uh, Michael Jordan and Scotty Pippen, that that that's how, so we got a lot of people, like, it'd be random. Like, we yeah. didn't have any, we didn't have people come spend 15000 with us, wow. 20000 
Now, Andy, you are a current University of Delaware student, so you have your pulse on the students that shop here. What do you see um, Delaware students shopping here? What do they buy the most here? The Yeezys, of course, Jordan 1s, Dunk Lows. Those are definitely like some of the top things that we sell here. Now, your role here, you handle a lot of the social media, right? Mm -hmm. How have you seen TikTok um, shape the marketing here for the shop? So we use TikTok to showcase the new pieces that come in that people can sign with, showcase some brands that people may not have heard of, like that we did a video on Warren Lattice pieces. We just did a video today on all our designer sneakers that we have here. We'll do like a Dunk SBs, Vintage, our Bape, our St. Michaels. We'll do all that. Is there one piece in here that you can recall like that I guess was more successful than any other thing that you guys posted on TikTok? A video that I did with one of our employees here at Pop where we showcased our different SBs of the week and just recently our foam runners and slides and we did to the background like a Kanye song. Where can people find you guys? People that are not in Delaware, people that are in Delaware, where can they find physical location, address, social media? They can find us on our TikTok, 302 Gallery, and then they can find us on Instagram, Gallery 302 and then our address and our phone number and everything is in the bio of both our TikTok and our Instagram. Well signing off here Gallery 302 as you can see everyone here is very important very strategic very awesome um, these guys do it man these guys do it so I appreciate you Andy no and the problem. rest of the team you guys continue to kill it.